Hello, this is John Foxy on channel John Orwest having an XCOM Enemy Unknown adventure. Now, I had a couple of, well, I had a, a sound problem last time. I have no idea what caused it, but the sound went all crunchy, so I had to turn that down. Uh, hopefully that won't matter this time. Matter? Hopefully it won't happen next time. But, anyway, let's move swiftly onwards. Two people, be, two people have been promoted, and Christian Bell's been gravely wounded. Won't be being Batman for a while, I can tell you. So, um, let's promote Clint Eastwood first. The assault class serves as our front line. They're the first ones into a fight, and the last ones out. Awesome. Okay. Allows firing or overwatch after dashing on on the turn. Ooh, that's cool. And, of course, I'm going to need to make them different clothes. Our snipers specialize in dealing massive amounts of damage from afar. But without sufficient training, they're vulnerable in close combat situations. Alright, one of them has to hang back, one of them has to get forwards. Fantastic. And because they're in my main group, I, uh... I will have to change stuff. Okay, hidden profit. Ooh. Weapons, I think I want that. Welcome back, Commander. But no, I want to listen to, speak to five you about stuff. our current fleet of interceptors. It's crucial that we keep several of these aircraft on high alert. We'll need them to intercept any future alien contacts, and it's likely we'll suffer some losses in the process. I think it's also worth mentioning that even a full squadron of interceptors will do no good against our enemy if we don't know where they are. Additional satellite coverage will be required before we are able to detect alien craft elsewhere on the planet. Visit us in engineering to build additional satellites. Goodbye, Commander. Okay. From the pause menu. There's a pause menu? Hmm. Ah, <clears throat> oh, contain difficulty. Never! I will never back up! But. Through the bit. Special once an Dr. Valen is the chief scientist. Additional interest. Fair enough. Let's see if I can make the graphics a little better. So let's put everything on high. And go back in. So enough and uh, so not quite finished because the arc thrower engineering we've still got some room to grow up here but if we really want to expand our facilities we're going to have to start excavating beneath the base unfortunately the deeper we go the more it's going to cost so if I want to build something where's my lab already So I want them to be able to, I'll put the lab here, oop, back, no, hmm. not quite yet. Yeah, let's go. I'm sure I'll need that money for something else, but I've got plenty of those. Commander, we've suffered a number of casualties and haven't found suitable replacements yet. We need to start hiring additional soldiers through the barracks. Okay, let's view the memorial. Oh yeah, I forgot about those three. I don't care about those. Twisty snipes. They didn't even get any kills. Oh. Alright. 
we are going to have to name a couple at the very least. Yes, because I've been, we're only having three in. So at least the fourth one has to be named. So who shall this be? Oops. Uh, Antonio. Bandas. I'll do. I don't know why it's going on. That's just I would give him a ponytail, but I can't tell. That's the sort of hair that um, Slump should have had, but it's too late now. There we go. That'll do. It should be red. And these two should be in white. Also, we don't have the big armor. Come on, game. Four days until I can have Arnold Schwarzenegger back. Uh, apparently I'm supposed to hire some. So... Oh, I don't have that much money. Just hire one. I still can't believe Dr. Vaughan expects our troops to try to bring one of those things back here in one piece. Much less oh, alive. Right, okay. Um. Several members of the council have expressed an interest in acquiring some of the artifacts we've recovered. However, we should be careful in choosing what items we release. The research team may not have discovered their true value yet. Commander, the artifact we're about to sell to the council hasn't been examined by the research team. I'm sure Dr. Volland would be disappointed if we put financial gains ahead of our own research and development. Just a couple of tech code corpses. Oh, apparently I have not researched. Okay, let's get into a mission, shall we? How the hell do I start up this computer? Satellite uplink facilities at maximum capacity. Oh, that's not how I do it. Uplink required. There. Let's at least get our arc for. Her. Okay, assign new research. We completed our research into the Ark for our prototype, and we believe this device will be ready for final production and engineering. The mechanism functions on a basic premise of neurological disruption, emitting a focused electromagnetic pulse capable of confusing and incapacitating targets within a limited range. <gasps> As this is our first venture into the field of non-lethal weapons based on alien physiology, it's safe to assume there may be unexpected results in the field. It's very likely that some aliens will resist the disabling effects of the weapon, in which case it might be more effective to weaken the enemy first. The Ark thrower is also constrained by our current power supply technology which limits its effectiveness to two shots per deployment and the captives or troops from the field will have to be housed in an alien containment facility. I strongly advise we build that facility before attempting live caps to capture live specimens. Okay. It's always ten minutes, so... Okay. 
So, now I actually get a choice. I think I want beam weapons. Beam weapons and insectoids. I agree, that does seem to be the most pressing of our current research options. We'll begin immediately. I will notify you when a complete report is. It's nice I've got the proper game, like, without him. Oh dear. Uh, and I'm at full power capacity. Oh, I can only have one. Don't know how long that'll cost, take even. Okay, let's go back in. Wonderful. Alien containment facility online. I don't think I can afford anything, but I'll click on anyway. I've got no credits. Actually, I'm already building stuff because I decided to build a laboratory for no apparent reason. Arnold Schwarzenegger's back! A transmission from the council. Wonderful! Coming on and Bruce Willis. I didn't even need Antonio Banderas. Hopefully I never will. A friend of the council has come under attack by aliens and attack and would reflect poorly on our efforts. If we were allowed to, our ally to, to be captured by hostile forces, we need to ensure his safety return to HQ. H H H we should have further details. Okay, yes, I need the money, to be honest. Launch mission! We are confident that you will handle this matter with discretion. Okay, somebody needs to have the stun thing, and I think I'm going to give it to uh, Eastwood. So, load out. Ooh, it's a shotgun. Oh, no, not the Eastwood. Let's give it to Dan. Somebody else needs the medicare though. Uh, that one, John. Why can I have? I want two. Okay. okay. <laughs> yeah, he looks just like swords to me. They have the same hair though. No, it's gonna annoy me. Go. Launch mission! Strike one. Prepare for landing. Let's begin assault. You'll be heading into Japan for the next mission. Find the target escort target to the extraction point. Okay, our last escort mission was, went badly. Launch mission, but now I've got somebody who can run and shoot, but only once every three turns, is it? Thomas Hutch, a friend of the council, was riding in the limo at the bottom of those steps when it was hit by an alien ambush. We need you to find Mr. Hutch. Make sure he's safe and get him safely back to the Sky Ranger. New objective oh, received. Watch. Okay. What weapon does he have? Oh, that's. Then hunker down then. Run and gun. Get him into position anyway. Hey, 
if we could really use a hand with these things. Oh, there he is. Oh, I didn't know he was there. Nervous, but aren't I always? And I can't overwatch. So I'll hunker down. Let's mix it. Clear to engage. Well, there they are. Schwarzenegger. He gets the job done. And let's put him on Overwatch. Do want to try and stun one of them there. No, that is not good. Oh, he's on Overwatch. Six, twenty-four. He's right in front of me. Okay, come on. Target still up. It's dashing. Got something over here. If you're looking for help, he's gone. We made a break down the street towards that delivery van as soon as we started taking fire. We were headed after him, but got pinned down here. Okay. Loads of things are happening at once. We can't see anyone, apparently. And camera. He's down there, okay. Just trying to just good. zoom out. Let's put him on Overwatch. Hunger down, because I can't shoot. Craig I might go for the thin man. Dead. 
Why did you turn? I need an old Schwarzenegger kill Rodriguez! What are you doing? They're on the move! Oh, bugger. Absolutely no cover. <clears throat> Why did Arnold Schwarzenegger kill Michelle Rodriguez? What the hell, man? Alright, come on, Daniel Craig. Go loud. God, get me the hell out of here. Certainly going to put in a good word for you. Yeah, I know. I need to get him out. We should get the VIP back to the Sky Ranger on the double. We have a new objective. Strike one. Opposition is headed towards you. Repeat. Hostiles approaching your position. We just lost one. What happened? Oh. This is a terrible mission. Security detail should be getting its equipment from your suppliers. Did you just watch like three of my men die? Goddamn commendation. I'm gonna be sick. Oh Is there anything else going on, game? Japan. Okay, well I've been John Proxy on Channel John on the West, having an XCOM Enemy Unknown adventure, and I'll see you next time.